everybody and welcome to Jeff's Baking Blog. Today I'm going to make some pistachio biscuits. So just a simple biscuit really, flour, butter, sugar, um, with some uh, pistachios which I've chopped very very finely and they'll go into uh, the mix as well. Should be nice and crunchy and very very tasty. So it's a very easy recipe. I'll start off uh, with the ingredients. So for this, I have 250 grams, which is one and two thirds cups based on scooping packed flour into a 250 milliliter cup of plain flour. I have 100 grams, seven tablespoons of softened unsalted butter. I have 150 grams, three quarters of a cup of caster sugar. And then I have 200 grams of finely chopped pistachios and that is one and three quarter cups after they've been finely chopped. The, the cup measurement would be different if you measure out uh, the whole pistachio but I, chopped, I, I weighed mine out and chopped them up and then I measured and I have one and three quarter cups there. I have four grams, one teaspoon of baking powder uh, 20 millilitres, four teaspoons of milk and three grams, half a teaspoon of salt. And that's all the ingredients we need. And I'm going to start off by creaming the butter and the sugar together and then I'll add the milk and then the rest of the ingredients. So I'll put the butter into my bowl and add the sugar and simply cream those together And then I'm going to add the milk and mix that in. That's going to loosen the mixture up a little bit. And that's good. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my baking powder and my salt into the flour. And I'm just going to mix those around. And then I'm going to add in the pistachios. And just mix them roughly. It doesn't matter if they're not fully mixed because as we put them into the butter we can mix them together And that's good enough like that. So I'm going to put that into the butter mixture and I'm going to mix that slowly until it's all combined and I can use my hand to squeeze it together. And that's all nicely combined and if I use my hand I can squeeze that I'm sure into a dough so 
So that comes together quite nicely, as you can see. And with that, just squeeze together like that. I'm simply going to cut it into two. It doesn't matter whether it's evenly divided. And I'm going to roll each piece out into a log and wrap it in plastic wrap. So we just form this into a log and the thickness of the log is entirely up to you. It depends on how, how large you want your biscuits to be. And I should say, if you find your mixture isn't um, coming together quite like that, it may be that you need a little bit more liquid so you can add another teaspoon of milk and see what that does. But we want it to be quite crumbly. And for ease, I'm going to make these um, fairly square or rectangular. Like that. And do the same with the other one. And there I have two pieces and I'm going to put those into the fridge and I'm going to chill them for an hour and then after an hour I'll come back and I will have a, a couple of baking trays lined with parchment paper and we will cut these into slices put them on the paper and we'll chill them again so I'll be back with you in an hour when we're ready to do that. I chilled the uh, pistachio biscuit dough for an hour and I'm simply going to cut it into pieces which are between uh, a quarter and half an inch in thickness. I've already done the first tray with the, with the other block. And then I'm going to put those onto the tray, leaving a, a gap of about an inch probably between each one. the ends can go on as well just like that and I'm going to put those into the fridge and I'm going to chill them in the fridge just while I preheat my oven to 180 degrees Celsius that's 160 degrees uh, Celsius with a fan 350 Fahrenheit and when the oven has preheated I will put the biscuits in and I will bake them for between 15 and 20 minutes I want them to colour nicely and they should feel slightly firm to the touch when they come out of the oven and they will harden as they cool down. I'll leave them for a couple of minutes on the trays then transfer them to a wire rack and when they're cooled I'll come back and show you the results. So I baked my biscuits for about 17 minutes and they looked quite good so I took them out and I've allowed them to cool down and this is what they look like. So they baked up quite nicely and they have firmed up. Of course, the, the baking time will depend on the thickness that you cut them as well. So I'll have a taste of the one that I've already been eating. Mm. 
has a wonderful biscuity texture, nice and crunchy. You could have them slightly softer if you bake them for a shorter time, but I like the crunch to them. And they have that lovely pistachio flavour. Very, very good indeed. So it's actually a very simple recipe. It just takes a little bit of time because of chilling the dough and such like. I hope you've enjoyed it. And if you have, please give me the thumbs up below and click to subscribe to my YouTube channel. In the top right hand corner of the screen, there will be an eye that you can click on and that will take you to a link for the recipe. And I'll put a link below the video as well. And I'll be back with another recipe in the very near future. So until then, happy baking.